Porzingis denying Skola. Lowry drives right at Porzingis. Kicks it out to Rosen. Valanciunas misses. And Valanciunas the rebound. And chance of we want Jimmer. Uh, been heard here. Actually heard a few in the first. That would, my guess is that makes him uncomfortable. For sure, he doesn't want that pressure. No, nope. like he's the savior. <laughs> and he also knows just called up on a 10-day contract. And Kurt Rambis said, you know, he's got guys that have been practicing and working hard and trying to improve. And he's got to be careful when to put Jimmer for dead in the game. So now the Knicks will get it back off the uh, fans. Various chants that heard a we want Jimmer chant. Knicks getting blown out tonight 116 to 92 with 149 remaining and number 32 set to check into the game making his Nick debut. He's going to be wearing number 32. Who was the first Clive? Wingo? No, one of your teammates on your championship team. Oh, Jerry Lucas. Some other 32s Herb Williams, Xavier McDaniel. The fellow Harrington, maybe Ronaldo this is Bachman. The, yeah, maybe this is why the crowd hung around, waiting to see if Burdett would be inserted into the game. Well, he's the first guard to wear number 32. And his mom and dad are here. This is really a lifelong dream. Read the stories about it today. Burdett for three. <laughs> Despite the score, what a nice moment for the young man. And in his first shot as a New York Nick nails it. And like Mike, he was not looking to this. <laughs> he, he knew he was putting it up. <laughs> well, he was lighting it up in the D League, averaging just under 22 a game. Shot about 46%. He was the D League All Star Game MVP with a 35 point game. He's done this before, Mike, when he was with New Orleans, right? They were he was on the 10-day contract. You know, the crowd wants him to shoot again. His best game as a pro was against the Knicks, scoring-wise, as O'Quinn misses that. They're pulling because they can give him the ball. Well, the final buzzer. That was the, one of the few highlights since the first quarter for the Knicks with Fredette knocking down his first shot. Tonight was Kyle Lowry's night. A superb performance from Lowry as the Knicks get manhandled by one of the best teams in the NBA.